subscribers. I also welcome new viewers. Of course, I apologize for my accent and language mistakes. We have December. I know it's not Santa head, but I record in head because my hair are very, you know. In this tutorial, I will show you how I did this scene exactly, how I did this animate background, animate wave in background and shader, which is a little similar uh, to Velvet. It's not Velvet, but it's a little similar. Okay, let's get started. This is my scene and my scene is shape, which is connect to Bender. Uh, a few picture uh, with canal alpha uh, is one uh, text 3D and uh, I will show you now how I create this wave animation. Uh, this is my shader, a little similar velvet and this shader I connect with this shape. Uh, this shape is connected to Bender and this Bender is connected next to this placer 3D. Uh, maybe, maybe I change, I check wireframe. You see now uh, this uh, little uh, wave. Uh, how I did this uh, wave? Maybe I uh, create a new uh, composition. Uh, we start uh, import shape from scene. We have plane. Of course, uh, we uh, change uh, x axis, maybe 20, minus 20. Change scale, for example light on and what what we need to create this way so we need displacer 3d so we connect displacer 3d we need bitmap we which tell fusion what is up what is down so our bitmap will be uh, fast noise we have fast noise sorry for example and add a little sieve rate a little sieve rate we have a little sieve rate now we connect we connect this fast noise with displacer of course of course we add subdivision to this uh, shape maybe 100 maybe 100 change we create maybe um, Four, four. This is only sample. Okay, look at this. We have a little animation, but we have uh, create vortex. In Fusion, you have option vortex. But look at this. This is my uh, this is my uh, bitmap. But I would like a little rotate this uh, bitmap. So in this fast noise. I choose vortex and for example in frame 0 my vortex will be uh, size 0 but in uh, frame 100 will be maybe this is for example okay uh, power 1 Look at this. This is my uh, bitmap, which will be generated my wave. Now we have, you know, 
In this technique, I create my wave in my uh, background with velvet. Next, we connect in this uh, shape, shader, simulate velvet. Okay, how I did my shader? My shade, base of my shader is Cuctorens. Cuctorens because uh, Cuctorens take you opportunity to uh, generate roughness. Roughness is very important to create this uh, texture, uh, texture similar velvet and uh, other and other fabric. My Cuctorens, look at this flowchart. This is base of my shader Cuctorens. Cuctorens in my Cuctorens I connect diffusion. This fragment is my diffusion. Of course, I connect bump map and specular color intensity. Exactly. My diffusion is this texture. This is this texture. Texture. With I uh, and this texture. Next, I blend with this texture. Of course, blend is. Uh, in this place, in this merge, apply mode overlay. Next, I merge, I connect, connect next merge and blend with background. And this background generate my color, my uh, diffusion. If I would like, uh, if my, if I would like, uh, for example, I would like red background uh, red uh, background my shader must be red i change in this uh, place color to red and my shader will be red uh, back okay this is my diffusion this is my diffusion my diffusion i connect to cook torrents this is my bump map this bump map this is fast noise this is fast noise uh, specular color intensity, specular color material, specular color material gener generates specular color material, of course. This is gradient, this is only background with gradient. And of course, I connect to my cook torrents reflect, but this ref reflect have a very small value, very small, small value. Now, then I connect my reflect with floor and I uh, have, and I um, receive this effect. It's very easy because it's only, it's only rotate and change scale this element. Of course, I connect, um, I connect to my scene particle particle system and my particle system uh, my particle system is uh, set uh, I show you this is my particle system and in style and in style I um, set bitmap my bitmap is this uh, is this flower so uh, of course, this um, PA meter generate this flower in Polish, Rumianek, chyba. Um, so, of course, I change uh, color and fade this, uh, this, this, uh, this particles. Um, and it's all. Um, of course, uh, my scene is connected to ambient occlusion. In my tutorial, last tutorial, I uh, show uh, how to connect scene to ambient occlusion. But in this case, I think this ambient occlusion is not is not necessary. It's not necessary. Okay, uh, I think it's uh, all. Uh, thank you for watching. I will be glad if you leave a comment and subscribe my channel. Thank you very much, see you in the next tutorial.